One of the most important charts in Six Sigma is the Pareto chart to help you figure out how to focus your improvement effort. If you ever tried to draw one of these in Excel, you know it's just not that easy. But the QI macros simplify that whole process. So here we have some healthcare data. Now we can either take defects, in this case it's surgical retained foreign objects, and click on our Pareto chart. The QI macros will go out and draw our chart for us showing the sponges are 67 percent of the total. This tells us we have something to work on. Or we can do it with money. So here we have uh, claims denied, no appeal, type of problem. Here you can see claims denied, no, no appeal, timely filing is 61 percent of the total. So this is a Pareto chart. There's some big bars at the front, one or more, one or two or three big bars at the front, and a whole bunch of little bars. If we were going to focus, we would work on timely filing. Now with the QI macros, you can do multiple Pareto charts at one time. So here we have uh, cart and manufacturing defects by line and total defects. Just select that with your mouse, click on Pareto chart. It'll ask if you want to summarize the bars, and usually 9 is about the right number. So, Or you can adjust that as needed. And the QI macros will go out and draw Pareto charts for each one of those. So here on line one, you can see we have bent and damaged flaps. And as we scroll down, bent and damaged flaps. This one, it's folded flaps on line three, so they have a different problem. And here's the top three bars. So we probably would have line three work on folded flaps. One of these work on bent and damaged flaps, and another one work on carton will not open. So those are some ideas about how to go about this. But you'll also notice that sometimes you have a, a whole bunch of stuff like this, and wouldn't it be nice to draw a Pareto chart of that? Well, if you click on the title of the, the heading of that column and choose Pareto chart, it'll go out and start summarizing every time those words occur together and prompt us for titles as we go along. So here's carton defects uh, by category. That's all our defects over there. So folded flaps, then bent and damaged, carton will not open. So that's the process for, for drawing these charts. And you can draw Pareto charts very easily using the QI Macros. Download a 30-day trial at qimacros.com.